but I was groomed to be good life because I'm so insecure. I was a monster because um, that's all I really knew. I was a monster. I see. Corner coming to loud live in the color. Hey, my people, welcome back to my channel. Thank y'all for liking, commenting, subscribing, give me thumbs up, thumbs down. Thank y'all for sharing my videos and telling everybody about my channel. I appreciate that support. I appreciate that love. Keep it coming by continuing to comment, share my videos, share my channel. I thank y'all. If you haven't already, subscribe to my channel. Turn your post notifications. So you will be notified when I upload a video, when I go live solo, or when I go live with Comedian Amani Jones. Speaking of Comedian Amani Jones, make sure that y'all subscribe to his channel, Armani Jones Comedy. Get him to 2,000 subscribers, 4,200 hours of watch time. I'm trying to get him monetized. Also, make sure that y'all watch Laughs and Libations episodes 1 through 22, seasons 1 through 3. Um, We're almost done. With season three. So, we're gonna look out for those last two episodes. And, yeah, we will be done, y'all. Um, Welcome to my new subscribers. Thank y'all so much for subscribing. I appreciate y'all. Thank y'all so much. Make sure y'all continue to comment. <sighs> I wanna talk about having abandonment issues. Having abandonment issues come from my childhood and not having my father in my life um i get attached to people i don't i'm not gonna say fast but i do get attached to people so when i get attached to you or i build a bond with you and then you move away or you stop talking to me or you just cut off all communication that makes me think i've done something wrong and it makes me crawl into my shell um sometimes it makes me lash out and do dumb stuff say dumb stuff um and i try my best not to react when i have been triggered i try really 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 hard but i'm human and sometimes that just don't that don't work um so i end up getting to myself um thinking praying um meditating i try to write try to read watch tv i try to do something to keep my mind off of my abandonment issue being triggered um because once my issue is triggered i'm thinking all types of things because the person that i feel like has abandoned me i can't talk to them i can't call them because they don't call me back they don't text me back if, no they don't try to keep in communication with me um and it just do not feel good to feel like you know somebody don't want you around um somebody don't want you in their inner circle anymore it just don't feel good um but i'm learning to not let a lot of things get to me I'm learning to not let a lot of things hurt me. Um, I'm learning to stay out of my own head and stay out of my own way. Because if I don't stay out of my own head, if I don't stay out of my own way, I will not make it another year. Um, so I try my best to work on me and my abandonment issues. 
I know there's somebody out there that has abandonment issues. I'm not the only one. Um, but I'm working on mine. Trust and believe I am working on my abandonment issues. Um, because we all have them. Can't say you don't. But some of a, some of us have some form of abandonment issues, and we just gotta work on them. Me, I decide to work, uh, write, color. Y'all seen my my coloring book that I made? I also I do diamond art. Um, I go to sleep. If none of that works, I just go to sleep. Because the person that I really need to talk to won't, won't talk to me or communicate. You know, so so when I have somebody that's not talking to me or not communicating with me, I just go to sleep. And I get up, wash my face, and continue my day because that's just me working on myself. And knowing that I didn't do anything wrong. That's just me looking at the brighter things in life. You know, everybody is not going to take time out for you. Everybody's not going to reach out to make sure that you're okay. To make sure that you're mentally, physically, spiritually, or financially okay. You have to make sure that you're okay because you are all that you have. So that's my advice for people that have abandonment issues. Do whatever you can to make sure that you are okay and not depend on somebody else to make sure that you're physically, psychologically, intellectually, emotionally okay. You got to do that for yourself. So, do what you can to try to heal or fix any abandonment issues that you have from the past. Because if you don't fix your abandonment issues from the past, they're going to come up in your adult life. And you don't want that, y'all. You really and truly do not want your abandonment issues to come from the past. Nope, you don't want that. Nah, I don't think you want that. But this is the end of my video. I hope that this video has helped some of y'all. Um, let's have a conversation. If you made it to the end of my video, put hashtag abandonment issues. Let's have a conversation. But in the meantime and in between time, make sure you give me those big thumbs up. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe to my channel. Hit the bell twice to be notified. If you're an old subscriber, make sure you're on on. Share my video. I can always say God only gives you one life. Y'all, please live it. <clears throat> Bye, y'all. I was groomed to be a good life because I'm so insecure. I was a monster because um, that's all I really knew.